Mishle, Proverbs 20, wine is a mocker, strong drink is raging, and whosoever is deceived thereby is not wise. The fear of a king is as the roaring of a lion. Whoso provokes him to anger sins against his own soul. It is an honor for a man to cease from strife, but every fool will be meddling. The sluggard will not plow by reason of the cold. Therefore shall he beg in harvest and have nothing. Counsel in the heart of man is like deep water, but a man of understanding will draw it out. Most men will proclaim everyone his own goodness, but a faithful man who can find. The just man walks in his integrity. His children are blessed after him. A king that sits in the throne of judgment scatters away all evil with his eyes. Who can say, I have made my heart clean, I am pure from my sin? Diverse weights and diverse measures, both of them are alike abomination to Yahweh. Even a child is known by his doings, whether his work be pure and whether it be right. The hearing ear and the seeing eye, Yahuwah has made even both of them. Love not sleep, lest you come to poverty. Open your eyes, and you shall be satisfied with bread. It is not, it is not, says the buyer. But when he has gone his way, then he boasts. There is gold and a multitude of rubies, but the lips of knowledge are a precious jewel. Take his garment that is surety for a stranger, and take a pledge of him for a strange woman. Bread of deceit is sweet to a man, but afterwards his mouth shall be filled with gravel. Every purpose is established by counsel, and with good advice make war. He that goes about as a talebearer reveals secrets. Therefore meddle not with him that flatters with his lips. Whoso curses his father or his mother, his lamp shall be put out in obscure darkness. An inheritance may be gotten hastily at the beginning, but the end thereof shall not be blessed. Say not, I will recompense evil, but wait on Yahuwah, and he shall save you. Diverse weights are an abomination unto Yahuwah, and a false balance is not good. Man's goings are of Yahuwah. How can a man then understand his own way? It is a snare to the man who devours that which is holy and after vows to make inquiry. A wise king scatters the wicked and brings the wheel over them. The spirit of man is the candle of Yahuwah searching all the inward parts of the belly. Mercy and truth preserve the king, and his throne is upholden by mercy. The glory of young men is their strength, and the beauty of old men is the gray head. The blueness of a wound cleanses away evil. So do stripes the inward parts of the belly.